All right, guys. Hope it. <laughs> <laughs> I need that is that any more, any more awkward? Alright guys, hope you're well. Um, yeah, as you can see from the title of this video, this is basically going to be dedicated to a little progression that I went through in my recent workout journey, so stay tuned. <laughs> Why is your voice croaking? <laughs> Shut up, man. Alright, so the two pictures that are in the thumbnail, I'll drop it in again here so you guys can have another look. Yeah guys, so as well as that, I thought I'd give you guys a little glimpse of what my physique is looking like now because as I said, that recent picture was taken last summer, so a good few months ago and I have added a little bit of mass as well now, so I thought I'd just give you guys a little glimpse of what I'm like now, just so you can see. I did just eat lunch, so I might be a little bit bloated down there, but that's what I'm currently looking at. Right now. And this is me at bang on 80 kilos at least, 81 kilos. So yeah, this is where I'm currently standing. They are about three, four years apart. So it's a three, four year transformation. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna give you a little bit of history on the first picture. I'm gonna take a little stroll down memory lane. Yeah, so the first picture, you can see I'm looking a little bit more flabby, you know, got a little bit more of a gut and all of that. Just been on holiday to America for a month, like, just eating everything out there, you know what it is, you can imagine what it was like. So I gained about five kilos, basically, so at that point when I came back, I was weighing 80 kilos, and prior to that, obviously, I was about 75 kilos, which I feel is my natural sort of weight and um, before that I did have a bit of muscle on me the picture's not doing me justice whatsoever but I did have some muscle on me for my age like especially compared to like, other people in my school and stuff like that I did have a bit of muscle on me because I've been going to the gym um, yeah so that's the situation that I was in and then interestingly in the second picture which was taken last summer which is probably, I was probably in the best shape of my life at that time in terms of muscle as well as strength as well as definition and everything um, at that time I was also 80 kilos so as you can see over the 3-4 year period my weight has stayed the same which basically I think has been down to first of all when I started training calisthenics I dropped back down to 75 kilos but for from just sort of leaning up getting more defined drop down that fat that I gained when I was on holiday and then now I've put that five kilos back on through muscle and now I've got quite lean I think I've got quite lean muscle and also my legs aren't that bulky so that's why I feel like I'm not I don't maybe weigh as much as people would think that I would like people normally think that I weigh more because I'm a bit bigger than I look like I weigh but yeah that's pretty much the situation that it is yeah so moving on from that let's talk about the training that I've done within that period of the progression just after that picture just a few months after that a couple months after that I started training at block workout so I started doing bodyweight movements entirely just calisthenics started off with a lot of push-ups pull-ups as well as running, crawling, you know, just the groundwork, the foundations, just building it all up. And then since then, just been entirely body weight, calisthenics movements. Um, had a brief sort of stint last year, 2016, when I was in the gym for maybe five, six months. So I did a bit of gym alongside my usual calisthenics training. So that contributed towards a little bit of muscle growth as well but also in that time I was also doing a lot more weighted calisthenics also I'd like to add that I wasn't I haven't been training through calisthenics to try and get bigger so to speak like way back in school when I used to go to the gym that was my first ever goal to just become bigger and just become more happy with the body I have like I was always skinny but I wasn't I just wanted to get a bit more muscular and just just feel good to have that kind of body but um, 
since doing calisthenics it's been mainly just about just getting stronger pretty much and the body has just come along as a result of that and I think it's just a testament of showing what like hard work and just sticking to your craft and just the fact that if you put your all into any type of training you can see results from it yeah so unfortunately I don't actually have really any old videos of my old training but I'm just gonna put in a little one video that I have that just shows that I made last year that shows a little progression between my muscle ups and how they've come along and also if you look in the video you'll be able to see the way my physique has come along as well so I'm gonna drop that one in here now So yeah, I hope that helps. Um, yeah, just feel free to comment anything regarding questions on how the progression that I've been through, the journey I've been through, like any interest you have in it, um, like workouts that I did that you'd like to know of, how I managed to grow with different muscle groups, how it all came together, like what more detail on the type of training I've done, just comment below, let me know what you guys want to hear, if you want to hear anything, if you don't want to hear anything, I might have just been blabbing and said everything that I needed to say so but yeah um, I hope it helps you guys hope it inspires you to start bringing calisthenics into your training and if not that just inspires you to just push and keep getting the best out of yourself so yeah thanks for watching guys and take care